Hey guys, what's up? So, I'm back over here on the computer recording now. So, since it's the month of October, we're going to be looking at some creepy numbers you should never call. And these ones actually work for 2021. All right. Let's take a look at it. So, let's find the first number. All right. So, we're going to call 187777 creep. All right. This is perhaps the least mysterious of the numbers, mostly because we don't we know exactly who created and why. It belongs to a horror themed apparel and merch company, Creepy Corporation, and they made it just for fun. It apes the format of many, many horror hotlines. Unlike the one nine hundred numbers of York, though Creepy Core Hotline is one hundred percent free to call. What's more? Alright. Well, we're gonna call that number. So let's call it. Let's see. According to the website it says we're gonna call one eight seven 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 two seven three seven seven. All right. One eight seven 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 three. Wait, seven seven two seven three seven seven. You guys, ready for it? All right, they hang up. Let's call it back. All right, well, the number clearly doesn't really work. So let's call this one. 646-868-1844. All right, while it's true at the initial message you upon dialing, it's weird. It starts an odd bell-like tones, which leads into garbled, unintelligible words. And then ends with an answer phone tone. Then second, Joe received a text message containing a jumbled mix of words. They're arranged to look like sentences, but they aren't sentences. They're just nonsense. So, I'm going to call this number. I don't care what up. I don't care what happens to the text, if I get a text or not. 646-868-1844. Let's call it. Okay, so for some reason, the when it says the phone number is not in service, it goes. They said a lot faster. Let's call it back. Maybe we'll get some thing. We're sorry. You have reached a number that has been disconnected or is no longer in service. If you feel you have reached this recording, an error. Please check the number and try your call again. Whoa! All right. So the first time it was all fast, but when I called it again. They said it normally. Hmm. All right. S we're gonna call eight six one eight six two five eight three one three. It's Murray Bauman's phone number that is it belongs to the Netflix series Resident Conspiracy Theorist, played by Brett Gelman. Calling it answers you with Bauman's answer phone recording, which seems to offer a few hints what might be in the store for all of us. Well, let's call it. The same time to get all scared. All right, six one eight, six two five, eight three one three. Six one eight, six two Okay, so that doesn't really do anything. That's basically similar to Sam Puckett, which I do have that number. So if I call Sam Puckett, like, here's her number right here. So I call it, I'll just get her voicemail. Watch. Hey, this is Sam. No one ever checks these messages, so 
just can't. Yeah, that's what you get. But, you know, it used to ring like six times before we actually got our voicemail. All right, we're going to call this one. 508-690-6143. Like another longtime favorite spooky phone number, this one has a special place in my heart because of its area code 508. 508. Numbers are based in Massachusetts, where I grew up. And I like the other Massachusetts based numbers, which isn't all clear. Initially, there's a loud, repetitive honking noise, some have likened to call horn, and others a buzzing sound before a minute or two of clanging takes the stage, like someone is repeatedly smashing a hard solid object against a tabletop or something. Well, that kind of sounds like the guy has anger issues, but we're going to call it. Let's call it. 508. 690 6143. This is Plumbing on Service. Hello? 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 Hello, I know you can hear me. Hello? This is getting creepy. Hello? Somebody there? Hello? Are you okay? Do I need to call the do I need to call an ambulance or something for you? That's probably this heaven three. If you feel you have reached this recording in error. Please check the number or try your call again. Okay, that was very creepy. It clearly works. Like, you guys had that car horn and that high frequency that I heard was going that could kill you. But phones cannot transmit a frequency that high in order to. It's not even enough to pop popcorn. So how could it be enough to make your brain explode? Okay, this one's a legend one. Nine oh nine. Three nine zero 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 three. When dialed, it allows you to convert with your own doll pull ganger, a popular in Japan. None of these numbers are actually cursed, of course. They're just test lines, phone numbers which allow you to test the quality of your phone through something called an echo test. Okay. While the other echoes your voice back to you, let, let, live and in real time as you speak. The 99 number listed here forms a segment of echo test, and that is if you call it, you aren't speaking with that, you're simply hearing your own voice all over again. This is going to be the last one. I'm going to be, alright, 909-390-0003. This might work. I don't know. I'm going to be creeped out if it does. Hello? 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 Is this number in service? Hello? 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 
and something. Are you there? Okay, I'm gonna stop that. Well, I'm getting creeped out by these. Alright. Let's find another one. I noticed I was getting it there, but we're gonna keep calling. Alright. Let's call 512-937-2346. This one is actually a second SCP number, although it serves quite a different purpose than the previous one. It's actually for call-ins from time to time. The podcast creator has put out calls in the SCP forums Let's just dial in and leave messages for inclusion of several holiday episodes, for example. You can still call out here and maintain messages, or the voice belt mailbox gets calls by creating them. SI is currently experiencing a site-wide lockdown. Alright, well, it's not going to breach me. Let's call it. 512-937-2346. This might creep me out more than the last one. Foundation of the Midnight Radio Hotline. Our site is currently experiencing a site-wide lockdown due to a containment breach. Please, stay on the line and leave your message after the phone. Stay safe. Yeah, that's... yeah, that's creeped out more. The number still works, even though it's 2021. Alright. We're gonna call the most... This is the one you should never do. We're gonna call the Red Room number. Alright, there's something just in our legend, alright? That means they're not real. We're gonna call this number 408 634 2806. 408 634 2806. You guys ready for this? We're gonna call this. It's gonna disappear from my message. It's gonna disappear from my history, trust me. It's gonna do it. <laughs> Well, okay, that didn't do anything. I'm guessing this number only works on Halloween. Let's call it again. Okay, that clearly doesn't help. All right. Wait, did I get any messages from that person? Whew, not getting any jibbers messages. So guys, I guess that wraps it up for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am very creeped out of these. I'm after this. I'm gonna call 15 numbers so I don't get a curse. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm Microsoft. Content you will enjoy.